Yes, you will be. And a bird could die too, so. Yes. And somehow I, I don't even know how I missed him there. But for a. Because DK runs off the edge and goes down a, basically a bottomless pit. Bottomless. Yes. He runs down the bottomless pit, runs ahead for about five minutes, and runs to another DK burrow, which we're gonna find in a quick second here. I think. I don't want to be proved to myself wrong again. Never mind. And another hit. I don't even know how I got hit there. I don't even know how I lived that one either. And it's like you jumped on nothing, but we keep our lives. The platform is a lie. Well, the imp part of it not being there is a lie, I should probably say. I'm not even sure how I dodged that bead, either. This is a yeah, I think, uh, I think DK was trying to smell the bees behind, but, yeah. Smell the behind of the bee! He went down the platform for another bonus. Behave yourself, Donkey Kong! Alright, I'll stop with the jokes. It's just so much fun! Actually, that bonus is going so many times in... Life grind. Yeah, life grinding there, but that's when I, that's not where I did my life grinding, as you could probably say. Either way, I'm guard is here. To help me survive a poison pond. And he's always happy. Always. Except when he gets hit. Then he runs off. Something I don't get, though. This is called a poison pond. How is it not affecting the monkeys? Yeah, as you can see, I lost Express Bow plenty of times in this part. I think I actually do lo lose them overall, but I don't remember when. He's still happy. Not for long. I tried chasing him down to cut actually grab him, but that's my result. And like with it. So yeah, it's like, damn it, I'm not you know what, never mind, just go with Diddy. From here on out I try to be careful, because uh, I really did not feel like recording this part again. With spike tires. Spike tires in water, however much sense that makes. But then again, as we all should know, do not question gaming logic. I kind of forgot, where did that start? I'll have to look that up and find out where I actually started. And if you would've went that way, you would've gotten better in guard. Yeah, but then I thought, no, I only got one hit, so screw it. If I had DK with me, I probably would've gone for it. But... Speaking of the devil, there he is. The devil. Hanging out with the dead in the street of Donkey Kong, yo. I probably insulted so many people right there again. That's not even funny. It's funny how these tires survive underwater and they sink and I just got hit by a fish. Yeah, this level in particular is probably one of the only water levels that I despised. Because they featured these tires for the first time. I think. And I remember in particular, these tires were the ones that gave me the most trouble on any water level. I think the tires, I think the tires are on another level, but I can't remember what... I think it's after this level. Somewhere. Yeah. And from here on out, I was stuck with Diddy being careful, because the try to go on forward, the fish will jump out of nowhere and try to kill you. But it didn't matter really, overall, because I had a 99 lives and up. But I made it to the exit. First try. I feel so proud of myself. 
a good thing there was no fish to end to kill you. In the end, there wasn't. And then we got off to the next minecart stage. Actually, I like this minecart one, but... This one or the last one? This one I like. This one I like. The first one... Eh. Yeah. I mean, the first part was the one that... The first one was the one that gave me a lot of trouble back then, but... This one, like he, like you said, I actually have fun with this one. It's weird, the harder one is more fun than the one that's supposedly easier. How does that even work? I guess it's the fact that it skips into more of the challenge? Probably. But with near death, more near death experiences out of the way. It's another bonus. I went for an express though, because I was afraid that if I got anything else, it would have got me another bonus, and I would have backtracked some more. Actually, I think if, if you're in a bonus, and you get a three of a kind, you go out where the bonus lets you out at. Do you? Yeah, that's only in the bonuses. I may have to test that out just to make sure. I mean, I don't doubt you, but... I'm just a little superstitious, I guess. I don't know. Well, if you're out in the, out in the regular level, yeah, you're going back. You're going to have play points for the start. Yeah, that's why I didn't grab Winky, because I, cause I knew he was going to do the same thing, but I didn't know if it did the same thing in bonuses or whatnot. I kind of, I kind of forgot. Bonuses are good to get taken outside the bonus. No. <laughs> yeah, no. Anyway, we move on to the signature level of this world, Blackout Basement. Or Basement Blackout, I forgot already. And in case you haven't noticed already, this part here showed my expertise in editing. Because if, if you recall watching this, go ahead and back go back to it if you want to. And I just got hit. Awesome. But anyway, like I said, go back if you want to, but if you notice, I came in here with only Donkey Kong, and came back with Diddy Kong. Just in case you guys are wondering, that is the master of editing. Yep. These rope bits kind of scared me, because everything went out, and include everything. Which... Yeah, no thank you. D looks down, it's dark down there! But it's dark out here too! Shut up. Dude, all the sprites got Not all the sprites. Yeah. Only Donkey... Only, um, Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong are being showed, actually. Yeah. But... Some of the background images, like that... The pipe and chain, they actually do show off. Not, not in particular, but they show off like they're being, like they're in front of Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong, and if you pass right by them, you can see them while you're passing by them. Which I didn't know why, but either way. You got Metal Barrel and... Right the Barrel! And I can barrel that way in. Kill a few things. Kill a cap clap trap and use it to brush to bash the wall. Yeah, I like this right into the wall. It still works. I'm not even sure how that works. The metal barrel makes a hole in the wall. Which I, I understand if it's thin, but something something off a wall like that. Not gonna happen. But either way. I came back here and grabbed the G and just went off. Cause more yeah, get out of the basement. Yeah, I went and grabbed the G because more lives are to be had. Which are awesome. Anyway, we finally meet up to the boss. Dumb drum. Kinda reminds me of that movie, um Not a Museum, the Dum Dum. Yeah. That was my first impression when I first came into this boss room. 
Although this came before Night of the Museum, but that still gave me the impression. Way before the movie came out. I still like references though. Even though they make no sense. But either way, this boss is pretty, pretty easy. For being a level, a world 5 boss. But even so, I still got hit. And now DK gets the honors. Hooray! And he hides behind him all. He's camera shy. But with that out of the way, World 5 is done, and we move on to the next one. Not with me though, because I'm done here. So, this is Kibatu. And Sharky2107. And we hope to see you guys in the next world. If we get to commentate anyway. Yeah, that is. If. if. That's a big F. But either way, we'll see you next time.